Yeah, yeah, there are. See, this is the thing, right? When you go to jail, yeah. The reason why a lot of people reoffend when they go to prison is because they don't understand that they're in prison for crimes that they've committed. There's some, there's plenty of men in jail. They still think they're innocent. Yeah, they still think it's the government that put themselves there. They don't realize it was their actions. Yeah, that put them in prison. Yeah? Now, obviously, there are some men out there, some women out there who are innocent. Yeah, every now and then there will be that one person out of a hundred who's actually innocent, right? And somehow they weren't able, their their innocence wasn't wasn't proved, right? But most men are in jail for 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 crimes they did commit, right? But they don't want to admit that to themselves. They just think, oh, you know, it just happened. No, fam. No, fam. You are a criminal, fam. You your intentions are bad. Yeah, you are a bad person. Yeah? And the reason why they rehabilitate, they, they reoffend is because they don't realize it's you, fam. It's you that's putting yourself in prison. Ain't Margaret Thatcher, ain't the government, fam. Just because there's guns out on the street, quote unquote, yeah? you picked up that gun. You went to my man's house. You blazed him. Yeah. And Tony Blair, fucking David Cameron, um, what's the other woman's name? Ah, uh, fuck. I can't remember. What was the last prime minister's name? I can't remember her name. Boris Johnson, they ain't telling you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Go, go on, Blaze, man, and stuff like that. No, you, fam. You, you, bro, you sold that car. Yeah? No one else, fam. When I was doing foolishness on the street, no one was telling me to do this stuff. If anything, people were telling me not to. Now, I have come across people who they fucking... I don't want to say they belong in prison, but they need to, to their jobs need to, they, they, they can't have, um, they can't be in a position where they, that they're in. Yeah, they're not allowed to have that job no more. Aren't they? I met a man when I was in fucking youth offending. A man's from South London, I'm from North London, isn't it? from Edmonton. Isn't it? Yeah. My youth offending service was in Edmonton as well, it was in my area, isn't it? Yeah. top of Bouncers Road. I met a man. And he was saying, like, yeah, I don't know what he was. I think Greek, but he was born here or whatever. Really. Yeah. yeah. You, you, you boys from around here, you, you lot aren't bad boys. Yeah. They're real bad boys are where I'm from. Yeah. South London. They don't talk. They just stab. So an impressionable 16, 17 year old who's trying to, yeah, build up a name for himself is hearing that, oh, okay. Because everyone wants to be the baddest around, obviously. Yeah. So if that man in... Them areas down, quay down there, yeah, are oh, not talking. They just stab him. Rah, we need to bring that to our area, innit? Yeah, like, yeah, man, they must stab him, man, already. But, you know, there might be a bit of chat between or whatever, innit? Yeah, or, nah, you know what? Fuck it. We need to just stop talking. We need to just not stab him, man, bro. That's what, yeah, that, that's what a man is telling a young, impressionable 16 slash 17 year old person in youth offending, who is gang affiliated, that the gangs in his area, they don't talk, they just stab. Now, maybe if you just made the statement, you know, it's a lot worse in South London, you know, like, you know, um, they don't talk, they just stab, whatever in it. But the fact that you're telling me, you, you boys around here aren't bad, yeah? In my area, they talk, they just stab. Like, you're trying to, bro, you're, you're basically glorifying what they're doing. And you're a youth worker. You're a man in a position who could be influencing young people in the right way but you're influencing wrong young people in the wrong way you're telling them not to talk you're telling them to just stab people and these are the people who are supposed to be in control of helping to rehabilitate young people so come on fam come on blood